have new information here at 6 about mold discovered on DNA samples, rape kits at the Austin Police Department's Shuttered Crime Lab. KXAN's Brittany Glass is just back from the DA's office with some new insight from the person whose job it is to use that evidence to get convictions. Brittany? Well, Shannon, Travis County District Attorney Margaret Moore tells me she's concerned about this development, but says cases likely won't be impacted because of the age of the samples found to be involved. Austin Police Chief Brian Manley echoed that message early this afternoon after he explained the lab reported that scientists found damp paperwork and mold on at least one container with a kit inside. Police say none of the evidence remaining in the refrigerator was used as evidence in a case. Chief Manley says while there was mold on the outside of more than 800 boxes, he's hopeful it won't impact the evidence inside. We have sent well over a thousand kits from this refrigerator out for processing. They have been processed and we have had no reports of mold in all of those kits. Coming up at 9 and 10 tonight, a closer look at what this development means for prosecutors and for survivors of sexual assault. I sit down with Travis County District Attorney Margaret Moore and a representative of the Sexual Assault Response and Resource Team who says there's a larger issue at hand. Brittany Glass, KXAN News.